So far, we've been looking at how .Mac helps us by giving us a virtual drive to store our documents, our photos, our songs, and our movies. It allows us to access them from anywhere, and it also provides us with a high level of security by protecting those documents from disaster. Well, the next feature in .Mac I want to show you is Sync. Now, Sync uses the same concept as iDisk. It uses the Internet as a storage and delivery medium, but now we're using it to synchronize our data, not just our documents and files like Backup and iDisk do, but instead what Sync protects is our address book, our calendar appointments, that sort of data. So let me show you that now. We access this by going into our system preferences. And in this preferences area here, we can set all our preferences for .Mac. The preferences for .Mac include things like looking at your iDisk and seeing how much space you're using. Your iDisk account ships with about 500 megabytes of space. If you need more space, you can purchase more space. Another preference here is the sync area, which we we're just talking about. Now, what sync is going to do is it's going to back up kind of the embedded data within our different applications, things like our bookmarks that are in our web browser. Now, have you ever been at a friend's house and said, oh, you've got to go to this cool site. I can't remember the name. So you start doing Google searches to try and find it. Well, you don't have to do that anymore. If you back up all of your bookmarks with Sync, you can go and you can access those bookmarks from your iDisk at any time when you want. Similarly, your calendar appointments, your contacts, your keychains, which contains all of your different account information for things like your passwords to get into different servers, that kind of stuff, that's all stored and backed up, as is your mail accounts and your mail rules. Sync will back up all of this embedded data and give you access to it and protect it when it's up on the net. And Sync does more than just back up this information and keep them up to date. If you've ever configured a new computer, you know how much time you spend importing all of your personal data and preferences and how long it takes before the new computer feels like it's your own. Well, with Sync, you can have your new Mac personalized just in a few minutes. And it's another way that Apple's made that four-way integration between the hardware, the operating system, the applications, and the Internet more than the sum of its parts.